Hey, what's going on? This is Al from Real Beat Sales. Turning your passion for music into real cash. If you need any help getting any tips on selling beats, marketing, any of that, you can sign up to my list. Get on my list. Uh, click the link below. I don't spam you. I want to send you something for free. I'm going to send you a free ebook showing you the essential things you need to win online. Um, like this video. Subscribe to the channel. I do videos every week i put up new videos give you information now in this video today we're going to talk about how not to sell beats how many times we're going to talk about this i don't know but producers please i am tired of y'all scraping emails from twitter and instagram and then emailing producers about beats and packages that you got Oh I got beat packs And y'all you don't even The way you present it Is just trash It's trash I didn't ask to get on your damn list Stop putting me on your MailChimp It's annoying now It's getting ridiculous Stop it That's not how you're gonna win You're gonna lose And then for the people that do uh Report your spam Let it keep going they're going to start hitting you with $500 fines per email. And then you'll start saying, you know what? Oh, I should have listened. To that. I should have never did it like that. How do you send an email without even saying who you are? Yo, I got beats for $100 packs. Check me out, fam. Like, who the hell are you? And if that's how you doing business with artists, I see why you're not selling beats. You're not a, it's a joke to you. Like, stop it. And, and when, if you do do that, scrape the email, go check and see. Go look at the profile and see if the person is a artist or a producer. You wasting all types of time doing that dumb crap. And the more you get reported on MailChimp, they're going to shut down your whole uh, account. And you're going to lose all those emails if you did build up an email list. I'm telling you right now, that email etiquette is serious. People take their emails serious. It's like they DMs. You just don't come in there, yo, yo, what? Like, come on, stop it. Like, it's we've been talking about this for too long, and y'all just getting dumber and dumber with it, man. I'm tired of y'all. Every time I open up my email, I go in there. It's 300 producers trying to sell me beats. And I'm like, do you not see my profile where it says music producer? Come on, man. And I know there's other producers out there that's going through this, man. That is it's ridiculous. Between that and then commenting, um, you post something about your beat, here you go. Here go this producer jumping in the comment or replying, yeah, I got beats too. Come on, man. Stop it. Stop it That's why you struggling Cause you keep doing that That's that's some crab in a bucket crap And you're gonna lose like that Cause people watching you Be thirst buckets You're a thirst bucket Stop it And even the artists see you thirsty And you just look stupid Right Learn how to market All these products up here All the stuff over here That show people how to win And really make money and you going about it all wrong and dumb. Look at this. Look at this. It's too much stuff over here. And you got too much information online. Come on. You're not winning like that. And and, and like I said, once those fines start rolling in, you barely making money for selling beats. You go for $500 per email for each spam you send. Especially if you sent out a whole bunch of spam. You be, you be doing it every day. You're doing about 500 spam emails a day. 35,000 times 500. You got that? I don't think so, man. Let's relax, man. Like I said, it's not an overnight get rich quick scheme. You got to trust the process and work smarter, not harder. All right? I don't want to talk about this anymore, man, but y'all are just getting ridiculous.